Ladies and gentlemen, thank you. I haven't started yet. <laughs> you can clap at the end if you like the show. <laughs> so, while the, the last people take a seat, uh, I'll, I'll just do a short intro. I promise I will not be long. Uh, the star tonight is going to be Jim and Data, as you know. But just before we start, I would like to ask you one question, and I will come down here to, to collect the answers. Can you please name your Luxembourg business hero? Your Luxembourg business hero. Please. Yeah. His wife, she must be a good businesswoman. Another Luxembourg business hero. Xavier Buc, well, you're lucky he's in the room, he's over there. So maybe a, a little applause for Xavier Buc over there. But I think you get my point. We have 250 or close to 300 people in the room, and either you're very shy, or we are lacking business heroes in Luxembourg. And the good news is, we are not lacking success stories. And this is why we, we did this event, basically. Uh, we felt that the gap between the noise, especially on social networks, and reality was much too big and getting bigger. We see on LinkedIn those awards, you know, I want this, I want that. But if you look in our real life, most of the time there's no impact. We talk about metaverse, about startups, about fintechs. It's a lot of words and it's, there's not really many effects. So this is why we decided to invest six months of our lives digging very deep into data. It's free, lbr.lu. I spent my nights in this. I don't know if you know, it's a, it's a business register. You could check my company's balance sheet and everybody's balance sheet here. Very, very interesting. We crawled with some friends the whole LBR. So I've got the 1,000 most profitable companies on one Excel sheet. Super interesting. We talk to opinion leaders. And as you know, we are not journalists. We are a communication agency, so we have a good relationship of trust. And they gave us some insights. And tonight, I want to insist, this is going to be a celebration of heroes. So Xavier is one of my heroes. And just before we start, maybe we'll, we'll talk about Xavier after or so, I would like to bring on stage one person to put you all outside of your comfort zone. Would you agree? Or am I spoiling the atmosphere? So Cyril, can you join me on stage, please? A big round of applause. If you know Cyril, please raise your hand. <laughs> he came with me. <laughs> and honestly, now I'm going to switch a little bit. This is what makes me mad. Let me tell you about, about Cyril. I met him in his company, I'll tell you where it is after, where he has more than 50 incredibly talented people. Some 2D um, designers. designers, 3D designers, 3D printers. I mean, this, this is what he produces is producing those fantastic pieces of art, and he sells them all over the world. This is not a startup. He's making 13 million euro turnover. When he started his TikTok account a few weeks ago, yeah. how many likes did you get in like five days? Well, I don't remember, 600K, something like that. 600,000 likes in a few days. Who else does this? And again, that's why I'm, I'm a bit upset. And this is the reason why we, we gathered you here in this room. We have in this room the top of banking, the top of law firms, the top of private equity, the top of everything. <coughs> and what I would like from this event is that Luxembourg learns to identify people like Cyril and to learn to roll the red carpet. His company is on Zahnweiler. I didn't need to go too far. Zahnweiler. This is where I found those geniuses. You will see them in the Duke magazine that you will get when you get out. 
And I, I hope it's going to be more, more famous. I know his difficulties as an entrepreneur. You can imagine he's shipping all over the world. So please, at the end of this event, go and speak to Cyril, roll the red carpet, and let's together grow this company to make it a Luxembourgish success, because otherwise, he cannot say it, I can say it, he will leave. You take BPI France, it's a, it's a war machine. They, they can give you guarantees, they can, they can make his life easier. He's here, he created the company here. This is why I created this event. I want us to link all the dots and learn to roll the carpets for entrepreneurs, not the one from tomorrow, the one from today, the one who already are here, paying taxes and hiring people. So thank you very much. <laughs> you know, I'm a big, big lover of Luxembourg, so now you know why we did this. I will leave the floor to Jim for a fantastic uh, panel, and thank you very much, Shiva, uh, from, uh, from EIB, uh, Winky from Amazon, and Philippe from Clearstream for taking the time. I know it's going to be fantastic. It's our fourth panel. And again, here, congratulations to Eva, because I'm very proud of those four panels. This is really taking the hard way into premium content, and I really enjoyed every project. And just before I leave the stage, I never do this, but tonight I would like to do it. I would like to thank my heroes, and this is my team. It's an honor and a pleasure to work with an amazing team. So Eva here is doing some magic. You have here Simon who is doing some magic. You have Amid over there. I guess Noel is still doing the check-in with Emma, sorry. And we also have fantastic talents. You know Eric over there, he's a good friend of mine. And we have Nelson somewhere. Thank you very much. You guys are my heroes. Have a nice evening.